out. You know what ruins almost everything I try to do? Distractions. And I am a heavily distracted person. My dad is a is a very intelligent person. And in his profession, which I don't think he would have a problem with me talking about, but I also don't have explicit permission to talk about it on the YouTube videos, um, so I'm not going to. But anyway, in his profession, he is also connected with a lot of other really intelligent people. And a couple years ago, I was in a meeting with one of those very intelligent people, and he said one of the most profound things I've ever heard in my life. This was a leadership meeting, and the guy's name was Ray Bench. Um, he's one of my dad's really good friends. He's my friend also, but he's my dad's age, so I don't know what you call someone like that. You call him like a surrogate uncle or something. But in his opening remarks, he made this statement. Distractions are the death of your dreams, in slow motion. I'll tell you what though, I thought about that statement the entire week after that meeting and I evaluated every aspect of my life. I know this may all seem kind of random, but it's not. You know, Matt or Torg, he's the one that's kind of inspired me to do this because he stopped playing Call of Duty with me to catch up on work and I'm not sure how I feel about that. And all that's to say, I, I understand I've got distractions, right? they're they're there they're ever present but i know now that i need to deal with them because i need to get back to the roots of what unbroken was and and that is to to spread the message of hope that unbroken is to as many screens as i can and i can't do that with the distractions that i've got we're at uh dalton's house for a little memorial day pre-game do you like cinnamon rolls? Yeah, I'm bad. I think <laughs> I think cinnamon rolls are probably the most overrated dessert there is. You're yeah, I don't know. Ice cream, ice cream is good. Ice cream cake is good. Dude, ice cream cake is so good. I can eat a whole day with ice cream cake by myself in 20 minutes. Same. So was that a yay or nay on gas? I like the idea of using gas, yeah, for sure. Good thing no one asked you. My uh, my buddy Austin here takes takes fire starting very very seriously. Dang, bro, you looking kind of thick today. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Austin got his gas. Oh yeah. And I don't know, I don't know what in the Indian hut is going on here, but we're, we're gonna rock with it. <laughs> You don't know the address? No, Dalton. Dalton, why would anybody just know your address? We just know where you I live. I know yours. What is it? Yeah, crazy. That, yeah. Right. Have you ever used this? What do you think? I think no. I think probably no. Right. <laughs> you don't even know. Holy cow. Okay, that's... Don't empty the whole can. That's way too much. Just put two gallons <laughs> on there. That was like $8 worth of gas. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <this> is diesel. <laughs> was it? <laughs> Madison, are you nervous about this? <laughs> kind of. Excuse me? Why does it smell good? Is that like a weird pregnancy craving or is that normal for you? <laughs> he said paint chips. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my mom fed me paint chips and then dropped me on my head a bunch. Yeah, true. That wasn't as impressive as I thought it was going to be. Yeah, I wanted someone to get hurt, Austin. Content. Can, can we go get Red Bull? Yeah. Like right now? Sure. Okay, let's go. You lose your freaking attitude when you talk to me. Take your time. Whee! That's right. And we're gonna exit the car but and go inside. What if someone needs to come here to get gas 
and instead of pulling up five feet to sit in a parking spot, you parked here with no intention of getting gas. And I know for a fact you're not getting gas because your gas tank's full. That's actually an accurate statement, but there's 12 gas pumps, only one other besides us occupied. Only one other one doesn't work, so there's nine other gas pumps. So but this isn't my a parking car. Spot. Actually, my car is parked, so wherever I'm parked at, and exit the vehicle and leave, it's a parking spot. <laughs> I was planning on it. Yeah, this guy parked here with no intention of getting any gas whatsoever. <laughs> I uh, I forgot last week's Red Bull, so had to double up. No. Dalton starts everything. No, I and then cries when start? someone comes back at him. I didn't start anything. Yes, you did. You're being rude to your wife. No, Whee! Madison is never like that. Whee! And then you guys come around and encourage it. And then she's like, oh, crown me now. I'm a king. What? She's still being sweet to you. I don't She didn't say, I don't know where it's at. Like, if it was me, I'd be yelling at her. Dude, <laughs> quit. Arms are the same size. Your neck. You should measure that massive melon of yours. <laughs> Nineteen. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. You gotta get the peak of the bicep, not the <laughs> decline of it. Not the decline, he said. That's not the peak. Where is the? Yeah, right you are on the peak, Madison. When there's not even a peak. Nineteen and a half. Oh, okay then. Oh, the arms are bigger than the neck, baby. Let's go. I bet my arms are bigger than my neck. <laughs> Austin put a big bag of wet leaves on the fire and he's all baffled as to, to why the fire went out. Look at look at this freaking smoke, bro. Oh my gosh, I'm There you go. I'm a master roaster. Hey, come on! <laughs> What are you doing, Austin? I got it. I'm not littering, I promise. <laughs> Holy crap, I cut it. <laughs> what kind of sorcery is that? Are you going to make me a smart Dalton? Yes. Like a good little wife? Thank you. I appreciate you. Stand up real quick. Thanks, Dalton. <laughs> I used to drink an unholy amount of caffeine. I, when I was working at Dollar General or the distribution center, I would take two caffeine pills with a monster in the morning and then I'd have a monster at each break. And then it ended up sending me to the hospital. To the place. West Virginia, Mountain Mama, take me home, country road. That's really good. Is that flash on? Is my LED light on? Oh, okay. Okay. Do you, how do you think I get it to work? <laughs> And be quiet because it's like 1 10 in the morning but that's going to be it for this week's vlog i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did be sure to give it a thumbs up subscribe to the youtube channel share it with a friend it would help me out tremendously i will see you guys next week do something nice for someone today but most importantly stay on broken. Uh -huh.